New at 11, if your child was hit by a car, how long should you wait for an ambulance? The president of the Baltimore City Firefighters Union says one 12 year old in southeast Baltimore had to wait 58 minutes. Chief Rich Langford appeared on Fox and Friends this morning. He says Baltimore is one of the busiest fire and EMS departments in the country, and right now they're simply overwhelmed with calls as they deal with severe staffing shortages. Fire officials tell us that 12, the 12 year old was hit on Friday along McElderry Street, and crews were there within minutes to help. The problem is they had to wait nearly an hour for an ambulance to take the girl to the hospital. Fire officials say she was a priority two patient. That's not the highest. And Friday was a very busy day. The patient was transported, um, actually not even from the location of actually the uh, incident. Uh, she had walked home or run home, and and she and what happened was, from my understanding, when she made home, the residents at the house said we we'll probably need to call and have her checked out. It does appear that the ambulance showed up around 50 minutes afterwards, but we have to keep in mind that our uh, suppression units, our EMTs, and they are paramedics. At the time they arrive on the scene, they're there to render care. Fire officials admit there is a staffing shortage, but they say it's a problem all over the country. Recruit classes will be ready to hit the streets in just a couple of weeks. Right now, there are more than 35 openings within the department.